I'm John Keslick. It's the 12th of uh, May, and we're at a site where there's a sergeant. Actually, it's the 11th of May. At the 11th of May, and I just got an extra day. Okay, so it's a sergeant, Sergeant Cherry. Uh, we just took psychometry readings, and we found it's a 17, 17. 17.7 .7 on both sides and we're going to try to compare it to other trees the tree was just planted recently this year it has a well around it we haven't been able to find where the roots are coming off the trunk yet that's going to be our first step in diagnosing this situation it has a well around the tree we've already explained that uh, that's not going to be in the long-term best interest of the tree. So we're going to look for the uh, woody roots. Okay. Okay, now we're... Now we're going to very carefully dig around the base of the tree, being very careful not to injure any woody roots that we may find or to wound the trunk in any way. We don't want this to be destructive research, but we do want to try to find where the, the woody roots are coming off the trunk. Here we have non-woody roots that look like they're going to become woody roots that are already, as you can see, if you can see that right here, are, we're starting to grow around in circles already around the tree to become girdling roots, I would believe. And uh, right here, let's see, right here we do have more roots growing around the trunk, around the trunk in a circular formation. The autopsy, you see what I'm saying? We're doing autopsy, not a necropsy, we're doing an autopsy. There's a worm, another worm, yeah. We're finding roots that are already starting to grow around in circles around the tree okay. to, I believe, at some point become a woody root and uh, girdle the tree. Okay. I don't know if they can see that. I'm... So we're just carefully, as I was saying, the Sorry. trying to the trying to find where the woody roots are coming off the trunk without injuring any woody roots we come across okay. and without wounding the trunk. So far what we're finding are these non-woody, pretty much non-woody roots that were, as you can see, they were growing around the, yeah. growing around the trunk, coming from down below they're coming from down. So when the tree is planted too deep, whether it was too deep in the nursery before it came here mm -hmm. or what have you, uh, the roots tend to grow straight up and then they tend to circle the trunk. Okay. Like, yeah, it wasn't really planted that much, but um, it was kind of sitting in a root ball, but... Mm -hmm. We do have a constriction uh, in the trunk, and what I'm coming across here is uh, w more woodier girdling roots growing around the trunk, okay. rather than the formation of a trunk flare uh -huh. and a root collar and then woody roots. I'm not finding that. What I'm finding the deeper I go is more roots growing around in circles around the trunk. Here's some more worms. As you can see, these roots appear to have been 